SNES Drunk. Hey, welcome back to SNES Drunk Plays Robotrek, and here we have another new enemy. It's a mole. This thing is able to duck into the ground and dodge any attack from you, which is why you want to do the backstab. Power up. We are in the Forest of Illusion. We are in the Forest of Random Battles. I just cleared out two there. And, uh... Remember that time way back when I said there not there's not going to be any random battles other than the gels? I was I was obviously mistaken. Jesus Christ. This is really getting annoying, but at least I got paid for it. Wow, thanks. I didn't even have a freaking chance to dodge that bird. It just jumped at me the second I came on the screen. All right, now let's try and trigger it and go around. Uh, damn it. <sighs> there was three of them there, so I decided to get out of there. I'm, I'm sick of... I'm sick of fighting these things. Jesus. It's cl everything's cleared out there. Nothing special. Yeah. Anyway, you want to go to the left at the beginning screen there. Don't go to the right. That will take you right back to the beginning. It'll just kind of loop. You want to go to the left. And then we have this person. Who might you be? Well, she's grown up. Uh. No. Well, I might as well take her with. Nothing I can do. I am... What? Anyway, yeah, that's Mint the Reporter. She's weird and shady and... I think the implication there is that she's trying to, like get you to... Are there any random battles here? There better not be. Okay, there's not. I think the implication is that she's trying to get you to... to find this house up here, or... and then she just complains the whole time. <laughs> like that. You're terrible! And she ditches you as soon as... She gets what she wants. So she, she's one of those people. But that clears the path for this uh, this old house up here. This old house. And uh, yeah, more spooky music. And the door opens on its own. That's kind of goofy. Anyway, let's take a look around here. Big, huge estate here. This ain't just any house. This is a huge... Gotta go all the way around. Nothing back here. What's this? Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm guessing it's locked. Yeah. Anything back here? No. Gonna have to bear with me. I'm one of those anal people that's gotta check everything in games like this. What's with the cow skull up there? It looks like, what am I, entering a Stuart Anderson's Cattle Company restaurant? Whoa, what's with this guy? No, I was. What's with the no? Yeah, there's lots of little weird things like that in the translation. I don't quite understand, but his name is Igor. Is it pronounced Igor or Igor? Hey, look, it's Shovel Knight. Two of them. <laughs> hmm. Something awfully unsettling about this place. Okay, can I go over here first? Okay, can't go that way. Ooh, look at that thing. Oh my, okay. <laughs> That's actually genuinely kind of creepy. It's a little doll that wants to... What the hell? Okay. I, uh... That's strange. <laughs> oh my god. See, and then there's things this game does right. I think that's pretty cool. Thanks. Rest as long as you'd like. Rest forever. <laughs> there's the doll again. Jesus Christ. Hey, there's a cure at least. And a repair. And the doll comes right back as soon as you turn your back. Son of a bitch. She will guide you to what you seek. That's not creepy or anything. Yeah, I totally want to sleep in this house. Anything over here? No. Okay. 
Can I make this doll go away first? Okay. Good night. <laughs> when I said good night, my dog just gave me a funny look. What's going on here? It's Rask. It's that one dude you were dealing with earlier at the in the grave. Uh, oh, they noticed I'm there. Uh, what the hell? Oh, that's not fair. I was just, I just got there and they already kicked me out. Okay, so now what do I do? Huh, okay. Uh, let's go back out, I guess. Gonna be honest with you, I'm not even sure what to do. There's that guy, he's going that way. He kind of teleported his way through the door. I guess it'd be easier than opening the door, right? If you could walk through doors without having to open them, I do that all the time. Oh, okay, I kind of remember this. You gotta stay, you gotta do stealth again and make sure he doesn't see you. He's gonna look back every so often. Make sure he's not being followed. So you just gotta kind of wait. And yep, there he is right there. Stay back. And I think he's... Oh, he already went up the door. Okay. Let's check out what's here. Hey, level 8. Right on. Boots too. I won't be needing those, but whatever. It's cool to have. Let's check this out over here. <laughs> My wonderful life. Hmm. Spooky. <laughs> okay. Can you be a little more vague, please? Jesus. And let's check out what is over in this direction. Shot two. Might as well equip that. I think it's bad. I don't think I've done any combining or anything like that with the other uh, shots. I don't even really use that thing very much, but it's nice to have. In fact, the other one is probably better, so I'll just leave that one on. <laughs> I want to equip a shield on on uh, Leonard, though. He he's not going to use his uh, his stuff at all, his uh, attack or anything like that. Okay, so now what do I do? Let's go back and see if I can go over here yet. Still can't get that doll, and I still can't go in here. Okay. Uh, do I go back to sleep then? What the hell? Oh, he's the guide's back there. Okay. I think I'm supposed to follow him in there. I gotta stay close enough to him, but not too close where he sees me. If I had to guess. So, keep your distance. I'm not exactly... I hate stealth games. I just don't have the patience for them. I, anytime I play, like, Unreal Tournament or, like, Counter-Strike back in the day or Doom or anything like that, I, I always go all Rambo, and I do not try and dodge anything. I just... It's like that old, uh, that old saying, if brute force isn't working, that just means you're not using enough of it. That's my philosophy. All right, let's... Yeah, you got to stay close enough to them, but don't lose them. So they notice me. They're talking about me. They're talking smack. Now I can go in and see what's really going on. Hmm. There's nobody in here. Hey, it's Mint. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. No, I don't want to. Are you kidding? It's an invisible wall. Come on, game. That's annoying. Uh... Oh, you don't say. Okay. You're older than me, so I guess I have to listen to you for some reason. 
Okay, that didn't take long. What was that? Let's check it out. <laughs> She's gone. At least I can get to these books now and read the suspenseful next chapter of my wonderful life. Hmm, so Rask built the clock tower. Why is that important? Another flashback. <laughs> oh, hello there. <laughs> Count is my name? What? Okay, thanks. I go. Yeah, could you speed it up a little, Dracula? Can I'd like to get through this. Oh. What, you have a hobby of hanging out in wells? What kind of hobby is that? Aha. So that's going to be important, obviously. Yep, got to find a key to that clock tower, I'm guessing. <laughs> well, stop reading now. The end. All right, well, I'm going to call that an episode. Oh, wait a minute. Let's go down here next time. Thanks for watching, and have a great rest of your day.